Hi, welcome to Luxury Bargainista LLC with your girl, your number one luxury bargainista, personal stylist Darnella. I want to thank you so much for joining me for this quick episode on purchasing luxury items at bargain bottom line prices. Now, you know, uh, my criteria at Luxury Bargainista is that an item must be genuine, genuinely luxury, designer, um, well-made, the fabric. Um, so in order to be uh, a, a great shopper, you must be an informed uh, and intelligent shopper. So you need to know your fabrics and you need to know designer from knockoff. And you even need to know, even in the midst of all the luxury designers, which ones are truly luxe and which are just blah, you know, as I like to say. Because everything in the store that has a clearance tag is not a bargain. Uh, so, uh, over the years, I've been uh, shopping luxury bar bargain items and have mastered um, how to buy them at uh, uh, at least, and 60% is my least, at least 60% all the way up into 99% off, even, even beyond 100%, just for downright steal the item <laughs> from the company, the store. Or the shop and my other criteria is all of my items that I'll be showcasing to you on the website uh, and or uh, reselling to you on the website are from high-end designer stores they're not from just regular stores who are selling you know designer items uh, what they call it uh, discount stores no these the items that I purchase for myself as well as for my clients are from, um, you know, luxury department stores. We're talking uh, Neiman Marcus. We're talking Nordstrom's. We're talking Barney's of New York and all the great stores where you know you're not going to walk in and get a knockoff. Absolutely, absolutely not. So, um, again, thank you for joining me today. Today I want to share with you... Um, uh, one of my receipts from a shopping trip that I did. This wasn't for me. This was a gift uh, to one of my private clients. Um, I'm redoing her entire wardrobe. You know, I told her, just, you know, what actually my middle sister said, just throw all anything you have out and we're just going to start from scratch. Uh, Donna was going to redo it from scratch. So, um, anyway, that private client is my big sister. Um, I call her Queen Deborah. So, Deb, if you're watching this, I love you. So, anyway, I'm having a blast just being a blessing to my sister and uh, redoing her entire wardrobe. And, you know, so um, before I even get into the receipt of what I did, one of my shopping episodes for her, uh, I want to just capitalize on that blessing, being a blessing to someone else. You know, God blessed us so that we could be a blessing. Uh, and, you know, I found that sometimes I buy things and I think it's for me. And then God says, no, that wasn't for you. You bought that for someone else. And uh, he'll say, give that to so-and-so. And, -so. and, and I, as the daughter of Christ in ministry and in and, and, and the spiritual realm, um, I love God. So, therefore, I obey him. And I'm a just natural born giver anyway. So, I love uh, giving things away. I love being a blessing to other people. Um, I just get a kick out of being able to bless someone else. And I find that the more that I bless others, the more the da uh, daddy God blesses me. So um, if God tell you to go shop for someone else or, or to give something to someone else, do it. Obey him. And I guarantee you, um, it's not for naught. He's having you sow for a reason uh, because he has in mind to um, replenish more than enough right back to you than what you gave. So uh, that was my inspirational note to this video. Every video will have an inspirational note um, um, inspiring you to uh, be the better you uh, and uh, also help someone else do the same. So uh, let's get back to what I was saying about uh, shopping for my private client, Queen Deborah. So, um, and I love luxury stores. The service is phenomenal. You know, I went shopping for her in the store when I get to cash register I pay for them give them her address and they ship it right to my private client I mean talk about service so that's the difference between shopping in a regular store a discount store uh, and a luxury store uh, the service is you know just 
you know, excellent. So you can't pay enough for good service, but I'm paying so little for great service. That is the mark of a luxury bargainista. So anyway, I was shopping for Debbie. Let me pull out this receipt. And let's just go over uh, some of the things that I found. I hope you're able to see really clear. There we go. Um, you'll see um, I saved, jeez, uh, 80%, 65%, 70%. See that? Off three items. I bought her three items. In fact, uh, you can see where the store is telling me I'm a Lux B because I saved a total of 160 is it $167.27. So here's the receipt for Pooh. Um, on the top, I purchased uh, Debbie a beautiful uh, silver link necklace. It, uh, and uh, it was originally $38. You know, a woman has to have her accessories. It's one thing to have the clothes, but you got to accessorize it too. You got to fix it up, fix it up, fix it up. So I knew she was going to need some accessories, and I saw this great um, silver link um, necklace, and it was originally $38. I paid $7.48. Um, that was a uh, an 80% savings. <laughs> Luxury parking Easter score. And then I purchased her. Now, these are some of my favorite jeans, especially, you know, being in my late 40s, you know, the midsection is not what it used to be. And so finding jeans, again, I'm getting more into casual wear that fits me, hug me, but yet make me look like I'm a little bit smaller. <laughs> my favorites are not your daughter jeans. Um, so they're my favorites. So I try to buy my private clients what some of my favorites are. And, what, and if their profile match, I think it will fit them. So hands down, not your daughter jeans. If you don't have a pair, you want a pair, dog. They fit snug. They fit so good. They're just wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. So um, I said, I got to send a dab of prayer, not your daughter jeans. And they can run you over $100 uh, retail, the original price. And they're well, they're totally worth it. Totally worth it. I mean, the, the spandex mixed with the jeans, the quality of the material, the quality of the jeans. You take care of them, they'll last you forever. Mine are great. I think I have about four pair um, and adding on to it all the time. So I got um, Deb a pair, not your daughter jeans. They were originally $114. If you can see it there. And can you see what I paid? Over in uh, to your left. My right, I paid thirty-nine dollars and ninety-seven cents for not your daughter jeans. You gotta be kidding me. Yes, no, I'm not kidding you. It is real. Um, in fact, for all of my not your daughter jeans, I paid about thirty-nine and sometimes twenty-nine. Uh, so my goal is to score something less than that. And then um, at the bottom of that, I saved seventy-four percent. Uh, for a beautiful blouse, um, I can't remember who it was made by. But she wears it all the time. She loves it. Um, so I don't want to say the name. But anyway, the original price of that blouse was $85. And I paid, uh, I got 75% off. I paid $22.31. So uh, I was able to ship my client three luxury items. For a total of $78.37. Oh, and that included um, the $7.95 shipping that they charged me. So, there you go. It is There's absolutely no reason to wear a uh, bottom dollar cheap clothing. Again, nothing's wrong with that if you want to, but you really don't have to. I, myself, I love that luxury brand. Uh, but my pocketbook loves the bottom dollar price. And that's exactly what I pay. So for uh, my private client's wardrobe, Queen Deborah, woo, she received some bad jeans, a beautiful necklace, and a top. I'm dressing her from top to bottom, all for $78. So again, I saved a whopping, what did it say? $167.24. Now, if you don't feel like being bothered shopping in high-end department stores for prices like that, I'll do it for you. I'll be your personal shopper, or 
make sure you sign up maybe for my monthly subscription box so you can get a surprise box with a luxury item at your level of subscription for me much 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 lower so hey you don't have to do it let me do it for you or if you are a shopper and want to spend time in the stores and just learn my techniques then sign up for a membership at the website, donnellamore.com slash luxury bargainista. Um, and uh, you could, you know, get membership and then log into and get my training videos uh, that show you how to do the same thing. So remember, you don't have to wear just any old thing. You do not have to have a wardrobe that speaks blah, but one that screams luxury bargainista. Thank you for joining me for this moment. God bless you, and God have a wonderful day. Until the next time, remember, if you're paying um, under 60% savings for anything, <laughs> you're paying too much. This is your girl, Luxury Bargainista, personal stylist, Darnella. Till next time, remember, save big and buy big.